Adam Joel Weitzman, is an American entrepreneur and philanthropist. He is the owner and chief executive officer of Upstate Shredding, Weitzman Recycling, a scrap metal processing company headquartered in Owego, New York and was awarded Scrap Company of the Year by American Metal Market in 2015 and 2016. Chapter 1, Early Life Weitzman was born and raised in Owego, New York. Weitzman developed an interest in art collecting early in life after his father and grandfather discovered two early American stoneware bottles during an excavation project in their scrapyard in 1980. Weitzman began collecting the 19th century stoneware and owned 60 pieces by 1982. In 1986, Weitzman graduated from Owego Free Academy. Weitzman majored in banking at the CW Post campus of Long Island University in Brookville. In 1989, Weitzman worked at a Manhattan art gallery, Herschel and Adler Folk, and opened the American Folk Art Gallery in Greenwich Village in 1991. In 1995, Weitzman became vice president of Ben Weitzman and Son, a scrap processing company owned by his family before eventually purchasing it from his father. Chapter 2, Career After losing his sister to cancer in the early 1990s, Weitzman quit a prosperous career in New York City and started back to his hometown to support his father in the family scrap metal business. He built up an interest in the processing side of scrap metal recycling, which led to the foundation of Upstate Shredding. In 1997, Weitzman opened Upstate Shredding at the Tioga County Industrial Park in Owego, New York. In 2005, Weitzman acquired Upstate Shredding's sister company, Ben Weitzman and Son Incorporated, after his father retired. In December 2009, Weitzman acquired an 11-acre scrapyard in Solvay, New York from Peter Matlow. In March 2010, Upstate Shredding won Tioga County's Business of the Year Award. Between 2012 and 2016, Weitzman acquired a scrapyard in Newcastle, Pennsylvania, a port facility in Albany, and Empire Recycling in Watertown, New York. By the end of 2016, they were collectively known as Upstate Shredding, Weitzman Recycling. That year, Weitzman won the Platts Industry Leadership Award and the AMM Scrap Company of the Year Award for the second year in a row. In May 2018, a U.S. District Judge found a former Upstate Shredding, Weitzman Recycling employee guilty of defamation. Weitzman and his wife, Kim Weitzman, have invested in real estate in Scanny Atlas. In 2010, Kim purchased the Krebs Restaurant, which was founded in 1899. The restaurant reopened in the summer of 2014. In 2018, Weitzman began construction on a Mexican restaurant, Elephant and the Dove, in addition to development of a sushi bar in Owego, New York. Chapter 3 Philanthropy Weitzman supports his local philanthropic efforts through personal funding and his restaurant, The Krebs, which he and his wife purchased in 2010. In 2015, Weitzman and his wife donated the restaurant's profits to 16 regional nonprofit organizations. Since 1998, Weitzman has been donating his collection of 19th century American stoneware to the New York State Museum in Albany. As a philanthropist, he has donated to causes such as ALS and cancer research youth, education, healthcare, community services and more. In 2018, Weitzman donated $27,000 to the Jim and Julie Beheim Foundation, benefiting CNY children in need. In 2019, Weitzman donated $100,000 for the renovation and expansion of the Rescue Mission's Clarence L. Jordan Food Service and Culinary Education Center. In 2020, Weitzman offered a college campus he acquired to any federal, state, or local government agency to set up a base camp to help find a cure for the coronavirus. Chapter 4, Personal Life Weitzman met his wife, Kim Weitzman in the summer of 2000. In 2004, de France left her modeling career to work alongside Weitzman, as an orations manager for Upstate Shredding. They married in June 2006 in Scanny Atlas, New York and have three children Clover, Monroe, Ray, 